around us, we can see large number of things. All the things can be categorized into two groups. These are either natural things or human-made things. The things that are formed on their own, such as plants, soil, rivers, clouds, animals and human beings are called natural things. On the other hand, things made by humans are called human-made things. For example, chairs, boats, houses, cars, buses, aeroplanes, etc. are human-made things. Mummy, the plants in our garden have grown big and our pet has also grown. But why have the sofa, chair, table, etc. not grown? Dear, living things grow whereas non-living things do not. Mom, what are living and non-living things? Let me tell you in detail. We can see houses, tables, chairs, cars, plants, animals, human beings, etc. around us. But all these things are different from each other. The houses, tables, cars and chairs are non-living things, whereas human beings, animals and plants are living. Kittu, have you seen lizard and bull? Yes, I have seen mom. Did you see? The lizard pulls out its tongue and eats insects, but the bull cannot do so. So, can we say that lizard is living and bull is non-living? No, mom. Both are living. Very good. Let's study some important characteristic features of living things. Living things also move from one place to another to protect themselves from their enemies. Plants are also living things. But they do not move from one place to another. But some parts of certain plants show movement. For example, sunflower. Non-living things do not show such characters. Growth is a most important characteristic of living things. For example, a seed grows into a baby plant and a baby plant grows into a mature plant. Similarly, a baby grows into a child and a child grows into an adult. But a glass, chair, table, sofa, television, etc. do not grow because they are non-living things. All living things have a definite life span or live for a certain time. After that, they start to become weak and eventually die. We eat food when we are hungry. Similarly, all living things need food to live. Food gives us energy, which is used to do work. Plants are only living things who can make their own food. They prepare food with the help of water, carbon dioxide and sunlight. All animals depend directly or indirectly on plants for their food. Whereas, non-living things do not need food. Keep your right hand on your chest. You can feel your heart beat. All living things breathe day and night continuously. Different animals have different organs for breathing. Lungs in human, gills in fish, stomata in plant, crocky in insects are major respiratory organs. These organs help take in oxygen from atmosphere and release carbon dioxide from the body. Hence, living things cannot live without air. Whereas, non-living things do not breathe. If you touch a hot iron or a hot pan, you immediately withdraw your hand. Similarly, all animals feel and react. Some plants such as touch-me-not plants also respond to touch. The leaves of touch-me-not plant drop downwards and close up themselves when you touch them. But non-living things do not feel. Living things produce their own kind. Birds and insects lay eggs and young ones hatch out of them. Rats, cats, dogs and human beings give birth to young ones. Plants also reproduce through seeds and other parts of the plants. Seeds grow into new plants. On the other hand, non-living things do not reproduce. Let us summarize. The world around us 
is made up of natural and human made things out of the things around us some are living and some are non living all living things grow breathe move feel react and reproduce all non living things do not grow move breathe feel and reproduce 